Hey guys, so um, today we'll be making a flashlight like the one shown here. Let me render it for you. Okay, so this is what we'll be making. To start, just uh, click File New and uh, immediately uh, delete the cube. Click Add Mesh Circle and then uh, we want to make it filled. And then uh, vertices to 64. And then uh, go into the edit mode by clicking tab. Uh, go into a different view. Kind of scale it out a bit just to make it a little, little larger. Um, then E to extrude. This is the front of the flashlight. Then I, uh, extrude a little bit more and uh, scale inwards. Okay. And just zoom out a bit. And uh, extrude the body of the flashlight. Click E once, scale out, and then uh, now you have the body of the flashlight. It's the overall shape. And uh, the next thing you want to do is uh, find the. Oh, sorry. You want to go into face select and select about two of these or however thick you want the button let's do uh, two and then uh, subdivide till you have the length you want oops okay and then you can extrude it out not too much but um, yeah, that's about right. Okay. And now you have the overall shape of the flashlight. Click uh, Smooth. And um, then you can go to the front of the flashlight and delete the front. Um, then click the Edge Selector. Click Alt, right click. Oh, sorry. Right click the. Uh, rim of the top of the flashlight and extrude oh, I'm sorry extrude then click scale inwards um, it's fine if there's like a little pinhole and then um, bring it downwards however much you like it's about that's good okay and then um, you're going to want to make the whole flashlight uh, black. And then uh, if you want, you can, um, you know, uh, you can make the inside of it uh, white. So, um, like that. Okay, so... Now that we have this, we can go on to the next step. Okay, so the next step is to do the lighting for the flashlight. So to start, just um, add a plane and scale it out. And uh, try and put it right underneath the flashlight. Okay. And then you can just uh, copy paste this. And then uh, click N to open the properties window. And rotate it on the Y axis by 90. And then just put it right behind. There you go. Okay, so you can just fiddle with it a little bit. And then. Um, you're going to want to um, turn the lighting to a, I can't remember which one it is, I think, oh, okay, spot. And um, you can uh, do whatever you like, really, but um, what I like to do is uh, I like to aim the lighting so it looks like the flashlight is um, actually functional. And then um, you can press uh, zero to, 
and then locked camera to view so you can um, make the uh, view you'd like and then you can see what what works and what doesn't so um, you can see here that um, the plane needs to be a bit wider so we can scale that as much as you'd like and go back to this view and uh, it looks pretty good so I'm gonna render that okay so <laughs> as you can see it's pretty pitch black so what I like to do after that is um, I sometimes add a lamp right next behind it so it, the rest of the picture is kind of um, you know visible and you can fiddle with it a bit just keep checking see so now it's too bright in the background so um, we can make the distance less This part's kind of annoying. You just gotta kind of want to fiddle with it a little bit until you have what you like. Okay, so once you fiddled with it a bit and got something you like, um, you can render it and um, then you're done.